fixed points are a particular state of a dynamical system that don't change. Meaning once the system reaches that state, it will not move from that state. That's why it's called a fixed point. With that, going back to our equation for a linear dynamical system, because those are easy to understand, what this means is that once you have reached a particular point, a state in X, of, with, a, with a particular set of configuration, right? Then the change that's predicted is zero, such that once you achieve this state, or once you are at that state, you don't move out from it. So what this means is at the fixed points, x dot is equal to zero. And so to find the fixed points of a linear dynamical system, you go back to the model and you set this up and then you set it equal to zero and you solve for the state that meets this equation. And so you don't need this anymore and you solve for AX equals zero. Now there may be more than one fixed point for a dynamical system and that's important. You should probably find all of them. Note that in this configuration with this write-up, there is always guaranteed to be at least one fixed point of the system. It's the trivial degenerate solution fixed point, but because this is a linear transformation, A, and because we can set the state to anything that we want, and there's nothing else that is going on here in this equation, a fixed point of every linear dynamical system is the zero vector, where every term in X is simply zero. Because if that's what's happening, then if this is zero, then no matter what you do to that linear transform, it's not going to go anywhere. The rate of change for all of, this, all of the variables in the state will still will be zero. So this is always true. This is always a fixed point, but it's not particularly interesting. The more interesting ones are the ones where X is non-zero.